Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Jamie aka The Bearded Brit here bringing you another add-on guide video and today we're looking at two add-ons, we're looking at quick mark and then marking bar. So they're both very similar and they're both literally just for marking pretty much. So we're going to do quick mark first and I'm just going to quickly uh, show the little bar that I've got here. I've got this up on macros so it's literally slash QM show and slash QM hide. So that's that's just a little setup thing I've got to show and hide it and all you do is literally click and click so before obviously you have to right click on there and then go down to here whereas now you can literally just click and unclick so easy it's very simple it hasn't got that many options like it hasn't got um, auto hide when you're not in a party things like that and it hasn't got say a hide option when you go into combat as well which is another thing I'd quite like but I just put up these two little macros to make it quite simple just to show and hide it very quickly there are some other options so if we go into interface and look at quick mark you can obviously show and hide it from here but that takes a bit longer than just having the uh, little macros down there which I set up um, you can choose the background color so you can have it kind of whatever you want really uh, there we go you can have bright blue if you want I just do it opaque so it looks looks quite nice in there you can have different borders as well but then they don't quite fit they're not quite even around each side so it puts me off a little bit and it looks far neater and not having a border at all and again you can change the scale to as big as you want but again just have it on one and it sits quite nicely there you can also have it vertical but again I quite like it and it will lock it as well just so you can't move it around so we'll hide that one that's pretty much all there is to see on quick mark it's very basic it's very simple and it's just you know it's quite handy to have so we'll move on to marking bar next this one's a bit more in depth so we'll go on markers and you can uh, show when you haven't got like a party so say you want to you don't want it when you're alone so you don't need to mark anything really or you want it when you're only in a raid so you untick that so even when you're in a party it won't show up or you can just have it all the time so you can just show it all the time uh, you click and drag it around using this little box here and again you can click this to lock it so you can't move it around and again to unlock it which is pretty damn simple again it's quite nice it's quite simple and you know it looks really tidy I like it you can also have uh, wait, where is it here somewhere you can have borders and stuff like you can't customize the borders or anything it just has a standard border around it which again I don't really like again you can do it vertically if you want but again not really a fan of that you can change the order of them as well which just personal preference I guess doesn't really make much of a difference and then you can lock and unlock from in this options menu as well but it's nice to have this little thing this little feature here just to make it a little bit quicker so and also you can not show it when you haven't got a target so then I click the guy and it pops up on the screen which again is really good that's such a good feature that quick mark doesn't have but I don't know I still do like quick mark it's very good and as well with this so we'll just hide that one then we'll go into controls and we shall show them when we're alone so this is the ready check and just things like that obviously you can pop up the options menu from here as well and announce to chat so you might be like what does that mean uh, but if you look in marker announcements it basically says to your party or raid what all the, your targets mean like what all the marks mean so you can customize these to whatever you want and then when you click that announcement tab it will just put it in the chat and everyone will know kind of what page you're on really which I don't I don't really ever use that or I wouldn't ever use that I don't I don't know don't think by now I think people know what marks mean or you're not using marks one or the other I mean most of the time you don't even use them but it's nice to have just in case I can't really demonstrate the flares to you right now because I'm not in a raid or anything but it has the tab here and it works the same you can lock and unlock using this and you can hide the borders uh, where is it there which is again quite quite nice quite sleek but again yeah I think you just like click and then place it on there which is very simple if you use these you can clear them all at once which again very helpful it's really good really good add-on in total but I do like quick mark because it's very basic it's very simple and like I don't really find myself using some of these features like the not having the target thing that is really good so 
just to have it pop up when you target someone is really good. I do like that, but um, I don't know. You don't really need it. It's a bit more complex than Quick Mark, and it has a few more features, but not all of them are that necessary, if I'm honest. Some of them are cool. Some of them are cool, but not all of them. So yeah, that was a quick look at Marking Bar and Quick Mark. They're two fairly similar add-ons. Uh, quick Mark uh, does a little bit less than Marking Bar, but they're not that different. And yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did find it helpful or there's another marking add-on that you use, then be sure to drop it in the comments below and I'll check that out as well. So thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.